In this video, I detail the Samsung lock screen bypass discovered by Sean McMillan and published today in full disclosure. A bunch of sites have reported on it, but not everyone talks about the consequences and what actually happens uh, when you use this exploit. So I'm going to walk through it on this Rogers i747 Samsung S3. So to start off, it works on any lock screen. So right now I've got it set up on pin and I'll, I'll show it on pattern lock later. So one, two, three, four. It is running 4.1.1 and the latest DLK build uh, for Rogers. If I go into lock screen, the phone is set to lock instantly as well as immediately whenever it goes into standby. So just to show that off, so it does lock instantly. So to do this, there's a bunch of steps and it takes a few tries to get it right and the timing. So go into the unlock screen, go into emergency call, hit the contacts button, then hit the home button, and then immediately press the power button. As you can see right there, it's already showing the home screen while the phone is locked. You turn it back on, if you got it, it'll go to the home screen. If not, just try it again. So contacts and then home and then immediately press power. There you go. So once you've locked the screen, or sorry, once you've used this bypass, you can no longer lock the screen. So I'm powering it off and powering it back on and no lock screen. Off, on, no lock screen. Other things are also affected, no notification tray, And the only way to restore your phone is by restarting it. So again, no notification tray and powering off doesn't lock the phone anymore. Just going to restart and then show it off with the pattern unlock. So once the phone has restarted, I'm just going to switch over to pattern unlock to show that it does work with a pattern. So settings, lock screen, turn off screen uh, the pin lock, one, two, three, four, and I'm going to go into pattern. So just draw a nice box. And backup pin one two three four once again one two three four and once again lock the phone turn it back on get the pattern lock and it does work oops unlock lock go into emergency call contact list home button and power didn't work emergency call contact list home and power again you got a glimpse of the home screen let's try it again emergency home and off it doesn't want to work now on video There you go. And once again, you bypass the lock screen, no notification drawer, and locking and unlocking the phone, no more lock screen. The only way to restore the phone is to restart it. So hopefully Samsung patches this bug quickly. And once they do, you can go on to XDA, of course. And if you go into general, and go into the sticky. The links are in the description. And the stock ROMs are here and you can flash them with Odin. So Rogers, Telus, Bell. Once again, thanks for watching and subscribing.